Christmas dinner has become granddad's purpose in life. Anyway, why don't you do what I do, eh? You know, just put the dinner in your mouth and think of England. <laughs> Granddad, I'll have a drop of wine. Not bad. Not bad, Granddad. Slightly underdone, maybe. Slightly underdone. I reckon a kiss of life would revive that too. That's enough, Rodney. This turkey's lovely, Granddad. Isn't it, Rodney? Terrific. There weren't any giblets in it, Dell boy. It was ready clean. Said so on the box. Yeah, I know it was ready clean, Grand. Then what they do is they take the giblets out, put it in a plastic bag, and they put it back inside the turkey, don't they? Still in it. I just didn't know it was in there, Dill boy. All right, all right. All right, Grandad. When you get overwrought, it's over and done with, isn't it, eh? Don't upset yourself. It's you know, it's like as the French say, it's a it's a fate complan. <laughs> Never will like him, circuses. Yeah, all right, you made your point, Roddy. Why don't you switch over? Yeah. Yeah. because you could be having a whale of a time now, couldn't you? Yeah, put a sock in it for half an hour now, will you? Boring. Boring, boring, boring. Boring! <laughs> boring! He went one in a minute, Rodney! Nothing's open out there and I'm bald. Hang about and I'll see if I can get on the phone and knock you up the Mardi Gras. <laughs> so you're going to stay in with me and Grandad? Look, if I want to go out, I'll go out. You won't. I will. I will, Dill. You won't. I will. You won't. I will. I'm all fat now. <laughs> <laughs> see you later, Grandad. You I won't. I will. Listen, if I... Oh, no, they've only pinched our table. Well, never mind about the table. Look at them two. Yeah, well, I wanted to sit down. We'll sit at their table. Come on. Well, go on, then. I will. 
<laughs> what are you doing? Hey? What are you doing? Psyching myself up. It's all right, be with you in a minute, girls. He's just psyching himself up. Shut up! <laughs> Come on, look, behave yourself. Now, look, this is kamikaze time. Now, go on, get over there. I will. Well, go on then. In my own time, Del. <laughs> Stop What was that silly walk for? Your gut's playing you up again. <laughs> it, was silly walk. it was body language. Look, I've got this book on it. Body language? No, I thought you were limping. I was talking to him. Um... Talking? You were lisping? You're going to leave the club. Leave? Yeah. Then when you get outside, you leave it a couple of minutes, right? Then you come back to the dormant and you say that there is a brand new Rolls Royce Corniche obstructing your freewheel van. Why? So that means the girls will be in here in the warm and us two shrewdies will be outside on the pavement somewhere congratulating each other. Then we're going to have to pay to get back in again.